Right, so this is the faults in the BSI, and we're looking at this one here, the starter for the rest of them. And not really that popular right now. That smells good, man. I know, yeah. oh, man. Full code in the engine ECU. No, no, might be a two liter. I'm not too sure. But here is the starter motor relay, and what I'm trying to see is why it's not starting. So I want to see if I'm getting an engine RPM. I want to see if I've got crankshaft and camshaft synchronization. So I'm just going to push that in and I'm going to look here. <laughs> Looks like the timing belt on this engine is snapped, my man. I think you're gonna have a timing belt issue. Got no RPM and no synchronization when the engine's turned over. It didn't sound too bad though, actually. Let me have a little think about this. So, looking down here, that is the, the chain. And ours, obviously, I would assume, even though it's quite far forward, but that is like for one of the camshafts. Yeah, I can see a cam lobe down there. So, 100% is a camshaft. So, doing that by pushing that start motor relay in again, we're going to see if this cam chain turns. Not even one little budge, yeah? I'm gonna look down here and see if the alternator belt's turning. <laughs> right, that means the crankshaft is turning on the starter motor, but it's not turning anything up at the top. So, unfortunately, this is a timing chain failed engine. Awesome.